something big is going down. First of all, Power Slap 9 for the first time. Power Slap going international. Uh, going down the same week as UFC 308 in Abu Dhabi. And they have got a big star who is on this card. None other than Paige Van Zandt, one of the biggest stars in all of combat sports. Coming back to Power Slap Page for uh, for a second time around. We know uh, Power Slap 8, 30, 25, unanimous decision. And uh, and now you are back on Power Slap 9. Uh, how you doing, Paige? I am doing great. I'm honestly really excited. Uh, the first Power Slap, I feel like, came out of nowhere. I think I took it on like two weeks notice. And this one, I obviously get to like train for, I have the experience now. So I'm extremely excited and I get to go to Abu Dhabi again. So I, I couldn't be more of a like of a better experience. Yeah, that's not a bad perk to get to travel to Abu Dhabi. Is this something when you know you take the first one? Is this something that you said I'm going to do again, or is this the situation was right and you said, "Hey, I, I had a lot of success the first time around, so let's do it again." Yeah, you know when I took the first one, I was just more of just like, "Oh, you know what? Whatever, I'll just go do it." It seems fun, exciting. It wasn't something that I like intended to do long term or intended to do again. But I had so much fun on the first one. I was like, holy cow. Yeah, I definitely think I'll do that one more time. I didn't know that the call would come so soon. Um, but then when they asked me to do, of course, Abu Dhabi. I, I, I've been there one time, but it was during COVID. So I'm excited to go back and get the full experience. Now, you said you have more time to train. How do you train for a, a slap fight? Yeah, so the first one, it was just kind of getting like the nuances and figuring out the technique on how to like slap somebody. Um, in this one, I'm actually trying to like lift more and train and get strong for it. And then of course, um, just again, trying to get the technique down. It's, it's just a learning process, transitioning from fighting to power slap. So I'm excited to see like, if my changes preparing for this are actually going to do, do well. I, I can just hear all the people page are because I pages. You know, she's got so many other, you know, things going on. Like, wh why voluntarily say I'm going to get slapped in the face with, you know, how as the how uh, the OnlyFans has taken off and all the other things you've done. So uh, tell people why you are voluntarily going to put yourself at that podium and, and you're going to allow somebody else to hit you. Um, Honestly, it's fun. It's competition experience. The preparation for this just works like hand in hand with everything that I have going on in my life right now. It's, um, of course training and like you know there, there's preparation to go into power slap but uh for this I don't have to cut weight I'm doing it at my current walking around weight I just feel like it's a fun experience and um I mean that's pretty much it I, I get to travel to Abu Dhabi for free I get to be in the whole UFC umbrella again so uh for me it's it's a no question is could you see yourself ever taking another UFC fight uh, obviously you've done bare knuckle boxing, you've done boxing, you've done, you've done a bunch. Could you ever see yourself going back and sort of in a, in a full circle moment? You know, as much as I would want to, and as much as that does excite me, there's a reason I transitioned to boxing. Yeah. I went from MMA to boxing to bare knuckle boxing. I have, so of course, I'm sure you guys are well aware. I broke my arm like five times in my UFC career. Yeah. I've had three surgeries on it. And it's just not something that I want to like travel down that road again. Yeah. So I'm going to compete and do absolutely everything I can. Well, um, kind of dealing with like, you know, injuries that professional athletes get, but yeah. this allows me to continue to be active and compete and be under the UFC umbrella without actually risking, you know, injury to myself again. Right. I remember that like gnarly scar and uh, yeah, it's like, crazy. Right? It yeah. Goes, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Though my whole forearm is the metal plate. I can like picture, I can picture that you're the photo of that. When you say that, uh, uh, who, do we know who you're fighting or do you have an opponent yet? Yes, uh, Chelsea Dotson, and my understanding is it's John Dotson's wife, which oh, is, wow. he's obviously a legend in the UFC, he's been around a professional athlete for a really long time, so it's kind of cool, like, I, I get to fight another UFC fighter's wife. That, that, that is very, very cool, uh, and uh, I get you out of here on this one, it seems like, you know, Power Slap, it, it's growing, it seems like it's doing great on social media, I, it seems like it's it's a sport made for sharing on Twitter and Instagram. I, do you really see this thing take it off? You know what? I know the passion that Dana has behind this and how much he loves it. Just talking to him about um, Power Slab, it excites him like crazy. Yeah. So I do see this continuing to be a big thing. I know the numbers that they pull in on social media. I'm sure that's the reason they were like, 
you know, thinking like, hey, maybe Paige will do this. Um, I think it just kind of goes hand in hand with the the trend of social media right now, right? It's yeah. like the quick action, get, get people's attention and it, it is blowing up on social media. So I think that this is going to go far. I think you're going to see a lot more people transition over from other combat sports, from other sports worlds that want to do power slot. Well, I... Uh... I, I've watched so many videos of the crazy Hawaiian on uh, on yeah. uh, social media and stuff. I know he is uh, he is headlining the card, and and now with you on it, this is uh, it's can't miss again. It's it's Power Slap Nine. It's free on Rumble if if you can't get out there to Abu Dhabi, like most people won't be able to. Uh, you can all watch for free. Paige, congratulations! Thank you so much. It was great to talk to you again, and uh, and go get her. Thank you so much. Yeah, nice to see you.